Hello everybody, this is George Ponder for Windows Central. Going to take a quick look today at the Windows Phone game, Blast Ball Go. Okay, Blast Ball Go, it's a puzzle game. It's laid out in board game fashion. Main menu is real simple. You've got your online, your local leaderboards displayed, as well as settings, and then to jump into gameplay. Now settings, it's got your sound and music, as well as a way to reset the tutorial. Now when you first launch Blast Ball Go, you'll be walked through a tutorial that'll explain game features and all, and the mechanics of playing the game. If you ever get lost or need a refresher, just reset the game tutorial. It is a matching game where you're trying to match five or more of the same colored balls together to, to eliminate them and score points. It's turn-based. The games are 15 turns each, and each turn is two-part. One is placing the ball, and the second is to shift the tiles that are on the game board. You've got two-by-two two grid tiles that you'll have to shift. So when I place this ball into play, my next move is to shift a tile. And you cannot shift the same tile back-to-back -back turns. And once you do create that match of five or more, you'll score the points. Now you do have bonus balls like these. It's a color shift. Tap on it and then tap on a tile to shift the color. You've got an X out ball that'll prevent the tile from moving. Then you've got a, a, a bonus ball that'll let you rotate, rotate the tile around. It's not a bad little game. It's Blast Ball Go. It's a free game. Now there is a paid version, Blast Ball Max. It's two, it goes for $2.99 with no trial version. But just for a, a nuts and bolts strategy type puzzle game, Blast Ball Go is not a bad option to consider. Again, it's a free game. It's available over at the Windows Phone Store. And as always, we'll have links to the po links to the game, excuse me, in the post. Thanks for watching, everybody.